5 Ways to Conquer Your Fear of Rejection and Make the First Move The fear of rejection is quite palpable and sometimes unfathomable. It obviously stems from some insecurity, that is still residing within you, and is making you embrace this fear every now and then. It could also stem from having being rejected time, and making your self-esteem weak and making you love yourself lesser. But life's not easy, and getting everything and anything you want, is not possible and it's important to understand that. The fear of rejection may have started when you were a child, but it magnified as you grew older, because your self-esteem was probably tarnished back then, with one or two rejections. Most rejections are usually centered around women, saying no to men, for a date or for a long-time relationship. It's more prominent than being rejected in a job, or by anyone or anything else. Here are 5 simple ways to overcome this fear. 1. Remember, women like men like themselves, even though, women may not be inclined towards you, they should still love your company and that should be easy for them to do if you keep cribbing about how it didn't work out otherwise. Women generally like men who are sure about themselves, and like themselves and that's who you have to change to, in order to defeat the fear. If not romantically, then definitely as a friend. Sometimes, women may reject you due to their own inhibitions or reservations, and not because there is something wrong with you. Always give others the benefit of doubt before you sell yourself short. Two. Build your confidence, the fear of rejection usually comes from lack of confidence, and it's important to build it, no matter where you are in life. Start with believing in yourself, and putting yourself out there. Connect with people, mostly women, and talk to as many as you can. Up your sense of humor and crack a joke or two, when you're talking to them and slowly let go of this tameable fear. Like Ken Rich, a 30-year-old computer professional, did. Kenrich says, I would be petrified to talk to girls, because I didn't want them to judge me. I then started reading books which helped me believe in myself. Humor was always my strength and soon, I found myself cracking jokes with women in my office. And that's how I became a whole new person. 3. Don't trust your own opinion sometimes, due to a constant fear of rejection, many assumptions about your own self spring to your mind. Assumptions about how you look, what kind of a man you are, how does the world see you and so on, and most of these assumptions are negative in nature, all brought to you by your own mind. The trick is to not let your mind win, and distrust most of the opinions it throws at you about yourself. If you find telling yourself, that you're not in her league or good enough for her, don't trust that opinion and try and change it around to, you are better than the rest. Only then can you slowly build up that self-confidence, and self-esteem that you've lost along the years. 4. Use your imagination well, sometimes, closing your eyes and imagining favorable situations can help let go of your fear. However, that doesn't mean you should expect things, that are not possible in your imagination, but building positive scenarios in your head, can actually make you more positive and confident. For example, if you imagine a situation of actually asking a woman out, instead of assuming she'd say no, picture her saying yes and see how it turns out differently in your head, and how positive your outlook becomes. You may just take the leap of faith, and ask her out and she may just say yes, making your imagination turn to reality. This is what happened in the case of 22-year-old student Karen. I was certain this classmate of mine had no feelings for me, but I felt so strongly for her that one day, I mustered the courage and asked her out one day. Her yes actually shocked me. Of course, I was thrilled too, says Karen. 5. Give up your belief in rejection, have you ever asked yourself, where does my fear of rejection come from? Well, to be honest, the fear of rejection actually comes from believing that someone has the right or the privilege to reject you, and make you feel bad about it. No one has that right, or privilege except you. There are men who get rejected by women, but do not react to it and ensure, they are as cool as a cucumber. How, you ask? Well, because they do not believe in the concept of rejection and instead, believe there are other opportunities, and other women they can always get. For them, rejection is invalid. 
you have to fine-tune your mind into thinking the same, because it's actually true. When someone rejects you, it's not them rejecting your entire being. It's them rejecting the mere idea of you, in that small, defeatable moment and so, you shouldn't feel bad about it because, people who reject you, don't even know the real you to begin with, and they do so because their idea of you doesn't fit with them, in that very moment. So remember, the fear of rejection can only get to you, if you let it get to you. But if you understand it and work on yourself, nothing can deter your spirit. Thanks for watching, and do subscribe to, Brainy Campus.